Poor snow cleanup has another person calling News 8 for help. A Naugatuck woman who is in a wheelchair says she snowed in her condo on Beacon Valley Road. News 8's Ted Coppy stopped by for a visit to take a look at the conditions. Gate at Pat Denzel's condo is frozen in place, much too narrow for her scooter to fit through. Even if she could get through, it wouldn't make any difference because, as you can see, the sidewalk is still half covered with snow. Pat Denzel gets around her condo using a walker, but her only way to get around outside is her scooter, and it's been sitting idle since late December. In other words, she hasn't been able to get out for more than a month. I can't get to a store to grocery shop. I've had to use Peapod. And that's expensive. And it's not just an inconvenience. She's missed several doctor's appointments this month, and she's concerned about her safety. I had a police officer here this morning, and he said, you really can't get out of here, and I don't have a back door. Denzel says she has other elderly neighbors stuck inside, and when you look around the complex, you can see why. There are a lot of ice patches and narrow passages. She says she's called the property management company, CNM, several times. I would like to see one of them in my situation. <laughs> you know, like I say, I appreciate all Mike has done for me. Um, but, you know, if this contractor can't fulfill his duties, then they need to find someone. So we decided to call Mike's company, CNM, to see what's going on. Hi, I'd like to talk to the person responsible for maintenance at Cotton Hollow Condos. He was out, but we were eventually put through to the owner. The owner of the property management company, Dick Family Getty, says this daily thawing and refreezing has made the situation nearly impossible, but he also said he's sending over a contractor today to take care of the problem. We're on the scene in Naugatuck. Ted Coppy, News 8.